Hey, hello everybody. Welcome back to the Tuesday MTG Flashback Series. Yes. So, uh, Magic. So, so you voted last week, and uh, I'll give you the results of that poll. 108 votes as of the time of filming of this. Some people might get still vote after we've already filmed this, but yeah, you, you, you don't Too matter. Late. You don't matter. You should have should have you utilized early voting. So anyway, uh, so I'll, I'll go from the bottom up. Uh, at the bottom, we have Blue Red Delver with 10 votes. We have Burn with 14 votes. Narrow, narrow victory for Burn over Delver there. Demigod Dredge with 24 votes. And overwhelmingly in first place, we have Waste Not Storm with 52 votes. And of course, if we had no- I think those were percentages. Or percent. Yeah, you are they percent? all the percents. Okay, well, it's pretty close to that. So, <laughs> I mean, so yeah, those it's are the pretty percentages. Close. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, and if we had a, an electoral college system, Blue Red Delver would be president right now, but. <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't, so he gets, he gets, he gets booted. Axed. He gets booted. So next week, your choices are Burn, returning again, uh, Demigod Dredge, obviously, returning again, and the two new ones are Green Weenie and Thopter Sword. So, that'll all be, yes, that'll all be here. And, uh, yeah. So, I'm once again playing Season Walkers. And Waste Not Storm. Yep. And because I won last time, the incumbent deck gets to go first, and we will see you in game one. Alrighty, game one. Go ahead and show. So it is worth mentioning that list this list no longer contains blue. Because oh, no. it literally was only for Serum Visions. I mean we had a split card that was blue black, but that doesn't really change if we just cut blue. And we had a few new cards that uh could be added to the list. Yeah. And uh I don't have anything fancy to say because I played this deck last week. Still that deck. <laughs> Alright. Go ahead. Amazing. It's the same. Yeah, no kidding. It's like it's the reigning champion or something. Well, we're going to go for Black Cleave Cliffs. Yep. And Thought Seize to see where you're up with. Well, let's get the ones you can't get out of the way. And here's everything else. Oh. Now, do I? am I more afraid of the Oath or the Sylvan Caryatid? One accelerates mana, one makes... Mana color is irrelevant? But Oath could find another mana. That is true. And that's it can. the thing, so I think I'm going to take Oath. All right. Oath down. You're at least not casting the carry with, with With my luck, if I would have Oath, it would have been three doubling seasons. <laughs> <laughs> you good? Enter go. Draw a card. Okay. Well, you kind of neutered my first turn a little bit, so I'm going to play Wooded Foothills and pass. Untap. Drop a turn. On account of the neutering. Huh. Well, that's that's a thing. So, we're just going to play an Inquisition. An Inquisition, <laughs> huh? Well, <laughs> I drew a land, so... Yeah, the only thing you can take. And... It's your go. I'm going to crack this end of turn. Go to 19. And I think... I'm feeling a bit of... White and a bit of red. Or maybe a bit of red and a bit of green. Ah, oh, the options. So many options. Never mind, there's only one because I don't have any sacred founders. <laughs> we will get a stomping ground. Stomping ground. Alright. Well, you definitely slowed me down a little. Just a bit. Unzap! Draw card. Well, I suppose that could put me back in it. Oath of Nyssa. Yeah. Look at tap three. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bird of Paradise. <laughs> Uh-oh. And then we'll play a Yavamaya Coast, I think. This is what this card is called. Yes. It's in Japanese. So, And we'll take one damage, 18, to play that birdie. A burb. Pass the turn. Untap. Rough return. Burb. We are going to go for a pyretic ritual, adding three red. Okay. So you got your little cutouts there. And then we're going to use two of that for a manamorphose, converting it to a red and a black. Might as well keep track of storm, too. I don't know. That might matter, I suppose. That might matter. So right now you're Storm 2. Then we're going to use... I would use my big dice, but I don't know where it went. 
We're going to use one of those red for a burning inquiry. Storm So three. each player draws three cards and then discards three cards at random. Could be anything. Well, those were not exciting draws, so I wouldn't mind losing them. There's, there was one exciting draw for me that if he hit it, yeah, it would break me. One, two, three, don't. four, five, six, and seven. So uh, normally for random stuff like this, we roll dice, and that's that's annoying. So since we each shuffled our hands, let's just do this. You get those three. Or get rid of those three. You get those three go. Okay. Oh, no. Oh! Elspeth, Nahiri, and Hierarch. You hit it. Salvage? Yeah. Yeah. That would have been an ancestral. Yeah. <laughs> well, if it makes you feel better, you hit basically all my gas. Well, that's good, I suppose. I'm going to go red and a black to Manamorphose for red and a black. Four. Draw. And then we're going to use this red for nothing, another burning inquiry. Okay. Two and three. Okay. Well, that's That was very unexciting for me. Yeah. Mine was... It was hard to top the crap hand that I had, so <laughs> it did top it. Um, you know what? You can have that one. I'm going to say this one. Yep. This one and this one. Okay. What am I going to lose? Hopefully it's not the three that I just Do drew. I... <sighs> it was basically the three that I just drew. Season, a Johnny, and a land. That's well, obnoxious. Black leaf cliffs. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Untap. Draw a card. Oh, man. Just got so many of these. Don't need them. Don't need them. Um. Okay. What do we do this turn? I think we start by casting another Oath of Nyssa. <gasps> I'll keep the old one. That does help you find some gas. That's kind of gas, but... I think it's probably better to take this Nahiri. Yeah. Nickel Bolus is a little <laughs> ways off. Just a bit. <laughs> um. Then... We will play a Simic Growth Chamber, and I will return this one, because it doesn't cost me anything when it enters. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Oh, that's very unexciting. Here we go. <laughs> Untap. Draw a card. All right. Well, I think we just go for a cheeky bit of... Actually, hmm, maybe this would be better. I think this would be better. We're going to play that coast again. We're going to tap these, t well, this one for a green. That makes it green already. That for colorless. Five mana. Nissa Vital Force. You didn't really have to worry about mana. You have an Oath of Nissa for that Nissa. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> Forgot I did that. Uh, so she'll go up, untap a land I control, and it becomes a 5-5 five -five till end of turn. So I will... Does it gain haste? Yes, it gains haste. Yes. So I will slap you for five with this Yavamaya Coast. Go. Drop. Yes! Ah. Okay. <laughs> Each player discards his or her hand and draws seven cards. Discard That's those what four. I was hoping for. One, two, three, four, five, six... And seven. Whoop. And just in case you got a dream salvage, these are the four that I discarded. Doesn't matter what they are, but it matters how many I've discarded. Yes. So, we're going to play a swamp. Yep. We're going to cast a dream salvage, which is one mana, and draw four cards. Pretty good. Seems pretty sweet. Also, I guess, just in case, I'll keep track of Storm. So that was two. Two so far. Storm 2. So, Exile Simeon Spear Guide for mana. Yep. Got ourselves a floating red. We're going to use good that floating red. And this for a desperate ritual. Storm 3. 3 red. Another desperate ritual. Storm 4. Didn't have enough four to red. splice it, I guess. No. And then we're going to use two of that red. To metamorphose ourselves to black. 
draw a card. And then we'll use a black and a red to cast a waste knot. Six. The namesake of our deck. And use this black. Do we be greedy or do we no? We're just gonna play it safe. Dream salvage again. For four? For four. Oh, seven on that. It's seven, right? I think it's seven. I mean, I'm going to use these immediately, but I just want you to know that these were my top three draws. Wow. So those are all getting excellent <laughs> for mana. Might as well get all of them. <laughs> we are at seven, right? Storm? Yes. Yeah. I believe that's just one. Two, make sure three, I didn't miss anything. Four, five, six. Just six? Seven. Oh, right. seven. Waste time. Okay. Good. On the same page. And that's a ridiculous top three draws. <laughs> that was, yeah, that was, I was like, wow, two in a row. That's insane. Yeah. We're going to use two of these for we had for a desperate ritual. Eight. And then go for a burning inquiry. Nine. Draw three. That is a card that we wouldn't mind in either or. It can be graveyard or in our hand. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, I don't like these three in the middle. I'm gonna take this one, this one, and this one. This one? Yeah. Said? Okay, you hit. <gasps> Elspeth Hierarch Aniland. You hit my past in flames, which was one of the cards that are. Didn't care where it ends. Up. Yeah. So I hit a land, which thanks to Waste Not Storm gives me two black. Well, it's just I waste hit not. a noble hierarch. <laughs> right. Yeah. Which gets me a zombie, and I hit an Elspeth, which is a non-land, non-creature card, so I get to draw. Yuppers. And we had one more mana, we could start a past in flames chain. <laughs> but we have to use five. That'd be pretty absurd. So, cards in hand. Seven. We are going to use a black and two red. Yep. No, we're going to use one. Yeah, two red. We're fine with two red. Okay. Dark deal. So oh, each ten. player discards all cards in his or hand and then draws that many cards minus okay, one. Okay, so this is this is going to be interesting. So I discard three and draw two. I'm I'm just going to say this is going to be interesting because this shuffles <laughs> everything back in, so it's going to be annoying to keep track of it. Just a bit. But uh, so what did I get? Oh, so that. you got four cards, two creatures, and two mana. So just one land. Just one land. Okay, so. Go up, draw four cards. Now, I draw and then this shuffles in, right? Because it's all one thing? Um, Yeah, because that's a trigger, so it's all yeah. one thing. So yeah, you'll yeah. draw... So the... I draw six, and then every, my graveyard shuffles back in. Yes. And I guess I'll just keep track with a number, because <laughs> you... Uh... How many cards you've discarded. Yeah, how many this cards I've discarded. So, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen cards have been discarded so far. So I draw six. Two, three, four, five, and six. Graveyard is falling off the table. Yeah. <laughs> and then all this stuff shuffles back in, including these. And continue. Okay, so we're going to use that two red for a pyratic ritual. Storm 11. And then... I'm going to take this off the table. It's going to get confusing. Ah, sorry. Okay, so we can use... We have six mana, which, once again, is still just one short. That passed in flames. <laughs> so, just just to make sure, Actually, you, got ev you got your draws off this, and you drew for... The yes. Dark Deal already, right? I'm going to actually wait on that Pyretic Witch Rule, because it might be important later. Okay. I Back. might have a dead chain, depending. Back to ten. We're going to use one of the black to Inquisition you. Okay. So, 
Basically, you get a noble hierarch. <laughs> I get a zombie. Okay. So that's... That's not really what So I that wanted. was Storm 11. Yes. And I've discarded 15 cards this time. Yes. Which I don't think you'd probably want to pay one man and draw 15 <laughs> cards at this point anyway, because <laughs> yeah, <this laughs> your, li- your library is looking a little scant. <laughs> so I think... Uh, yeah. Um... Yeah, I've used all my Simian Spirit Guides, so... Flashing back... It's not good enough. It's your go. Okay. <laughs> Untap. Draw card. Alright. Um, so against a more creature-focused matchup, I'd have had quite yeah. the army here. Yeah, definitely. Unfortunately, you have Nissa Vital Force and a birds mm-hmm. still. So I think she'll... Go off, get an emblem where if yeah. I play a land, to draw a card. I don't think we actually have that emblem, so. I don't think we do. I'll just, I'll use Mr. Boopster <laughs> as that emblem. Um, okay. So then, we're going to play a planes, drawing a card. And then we're gonna cast a doubling season. Ugh. And pass the turn. Untap. And if anyone's wondering, this taps for two mana. So that's that's how that happened. Draw for turn. I mean, yeah. Okay, reforge the soul. <laughs> reforge the soul. So discard my hand and draw seven. I Can I, before I can cast this, do I have priority? Um, I, before you cast this? So, like, I've revealed it. You may cast this card for its miracle cost when you draw it, if it's the first card you drew this turn. Do I go to my main phase? I think I do, don't I? No, no. This gets cast when you miracle it. Okay, so I've miracled it. Do I have priority first? Basically. Well, I have it first, but then I think you do I get, get it. Because I, I, I think so. Basically, can I cast this is the question. Um, can I cast this card? Yeah, I think you can respond to the miracle trigger. Okay, because you're so, responding to the miracle trigger. The Pyretic ritual, adding three, and then. But I think you. But I think you have to. I think. Hmm. My question is: I wonder if you have to pay for that first, because it's like your. So your the miracle trigger is that, and then before the spell is cast, you do that. Oh. I'm I'm not actually sure. You're probably right. In which case, I'm going to discard it, because I don't want to get rid of my black. So, you, so you're just so, going to cast it? Or? Yeah, just casting it. Okay. Just casting this. Okay. Storm one, just in case. Actually, no. Wait, because as long as you discard a land, I'm fine. Yeah. So, so you're going to respond to that yeah, with... With Pyretic Ritual and okay. three black. Or three red. Sorry. Okay. So you have three red, and then that's being resolved right now. Yes. Okay. So I discard those five and draw seven. So I get four black by the looks of it. I'm really upset with you, by the way, because I could have had an army of kittens. <laughs> but uh, three draws. Yeah, so you draw three and four black. Oh, that's not really what we want. Six, seven. So that's how many cards are left. So there's. Five cards left in my library. You might want to be very cautious here. <laughs> There's five cards left in my library. <laughs> but if but think about this. If you can't kill me this turn and I have a Nahiri, I'm going to force you to draw one more. So realistically, you're allowed to draw three cards without dying. <sighs> okay. And this is a must, by the way, if anyone's yes. wondering. So you have to tread very yeah, well, cautiously. It's a must. Very cautiously. So we're going to start... By flashing back past in flames. Storm three. Using the three red and two black. Or I guess two red and three black is probably the correct choice. Okay. This leaves us that. Four, seven. Can I maths here? I don't know if you can maths here. That's what I should have. Yes. And then use that red and a black to go for... Flashback Paretic Ritual, where is one? That doesn't have flash. Oh, now, yeah, yeah. right. And Everything has flashback. Flames. Yeah. Yagmas will in red, sort of. Four. Four red. Can I, uh, 
How does how does this work? Display under yeah, as you play an arcane spell, you may reveal this card from your hand. Do I have one in my hand? I yeah, you need one in your hand for that. Okay, and so you've used three, so back. I don't think you can. Adding an extra one. Yeah, Are you keeping track of the storm. Uh, I was. That's so. That's your I'm cast two, fifth spell, right? So two, three, four, five. Yeah, yeah. five spells. Is that one in exile? You can't see it on screen, but there's another oh, no. Desperate Ritual there. So you're going to do that, too? Six. Six. Seven. Seven. Eight. Eight. Nine. Nine. Tenth spell. Faithless Looting. Draw two. Discard two. Oh. <laughs> this is uh, this is pretty spoopy. Draw those two. And we're going to discard Dark Deal and Reforge the Soul. Yep. And then... We're going to... How many Manamorphos do I have in my grave? Uh, keep in mind those ones, whatever you discard up that doesn't have flashback this turn, because... Yes. Yeah. All cards in my graveyard at that time. So Faithless yeah. Looting, I would have to pay the 3-4. Yep. Yeah. If I flash it back. Just so there's no confusion. Although, <laughs> you can't really draw and discard that many more cards anyway. So. No. So I have three Manamorphos here? I think so. We're going to cast... We're going to flash back two of them. Okay. So that's two more Storm. Yeah, you're up to 12. Drawing. Drawing. Are you kidding me? So is this Grape Shot? That's Grape Shot. That's hilarious. <laughs> Manamorphose converting to black. And... Well, you can only... Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. the first one's going to convert to red to black. Sure. And the second one's going to convert and just stay the same. Okay. That... Oh, no. That one is in my hand. Because I just got it. Then... Play my land for the turn. Yep. <laughs> this is a really interesting game. I can flash back an Inquisition. 13. For you. <laughs> so. One. I know what you have to take. <laughs> so yeah, it's going to be birds. Here's a zombie. Um, what was the rest of the hand? Uh, three oaths, a Sarkin, a Tamiyo, and a land. Hmm. And we're at Storm 13. Yes. Uh, I think... Did I count the Inquisition for this one? Let me just make sure here. That plus two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, three. nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so, 13. So you need five more. We can. All right. Pyretic Ritual from a hand. 14. Put it in the no flashback zone. Right. Not that that's an actual zone, but... <laughs> These ones don't yeah. have flashback. The rest of this brick has flashback. Yeah. Fourteen. I guess we can use... Let's use this. Okay. And a red. Cast a Waste Knot. Fifteen. For the sole purpose of just casting it. Yep. Um. That says... Let's use another one of these. And a red. Cast another Waste Knot. Sixteen. Oh. Let's... Cast Manamorphose from a hand. 17. Adding two Doesn't black. really matter what you add. <laughs> to draw. And then let's grape shot you. For 18. Exactly lethal. I did have these zombies, I guess, as leftovers. Well, that wouldn't have mattered because the next turn... But I no, like, these ones could have attacked because these are from last turn. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I did that's have 
and yeah, you had it no six damage. What. So yeah, that's true. That's true. But man, that was a high enough. Those are some pretty stellar top decks. <laughs> you miracled that card twice. That's pretty good. Now I, I just want to know this. And I of, drew every card in my library. Yeah, exactly. I I just want to know this out of curiosity. So I would have played this, drawn three cards, and got the emblem. So I'm just curious what I could have cast. Nothing great. I could have uh, made Sarkin. a bunch of un- indestructible dragons, I guess, but... Yeah. Dr- oh. yeah. And then cast all those oaths to find things. That's true. That's true. All You'd right. You'd probably find a Dahiri or something in there. Or a second Sarkin would do it as well. So, that was game one. It was a very interesting game. <laughs> and, and it was. Uh, we're going to move to sideboards now. All right, so sideboarding for me... Um, Core Firewalker seems pretty good because you have yeah. a whole ton of red spells, <laughs> and it, it just and kills it, this, and it does kill Grape Shot. I do have the second Grape yeah. Shot, which is yeah, nice because apparently sometimes your Grape Shot's the last card in your library. Apparently that's <laughs> true, and a Natural State's pretty insane against Waste Knot and Blood Moon for what that's worth. Yes. Um, beyond that, I could bring in these to get rid of zombies, but I don't. I'm not too worried about Death by Zombies. As much as yeah, uh, you don't have a ton of grape shot and so all that. It's not like yeah, discard. You're you're more likely to hit lands and non-creature spells than you are creatures. Though if I have to fight through a core firewalker, it is only yeah, zombies. But yeah, that is true. then you don't want to you know kill your core firewalker. Mm-hmm. To... So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in two firewalkers in the natural state. The reason I'm not bringing in the full regiment of three is I'm not facing like a burn deck where it's just absolutely absurd, and yes. I don't want to cut too deeply into what I'm doing. As for me. I do have a Hero's Downfall as my third Terminate, which is funny, but normally <laughs> you just go in directly into the instant ultimate, and that doesn't matter. So I don't think I need it. Terminates, I mean, they can't target Core Firewalkers, they can't, and targeting your Mana Dorks is like whatever. Graph Trigger's Cage, this does prevent Emrakul from the Heary, but yeah, that's, that's not worth it. Coligan's Command is basically anti-finity. Has some other things. Anger of the Gods and Damnation. Maybe, but not really worth it. Grape Shot, obviously not. Blood Moons, of course, though. Because this deck can incidentally just have a turn one Blood Moon. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's which definitely is possible. Disgusting. Uh, the nice thing, the nice thing about my deck being not super soft to Blood Moon is Oath of Nyssa just kind of blanks it for Planeswalker spells. Yes. So I can just pay. Can I can also yeah, exile it. I can just pay after you've cast her. I can just pay four red for a Garrick or something. So you know? cut probably an Inquisition. It's not as good against you. You have quite a bit higher drops. Yeah. That Thought Seize can handle instead. Dark Deal's the weakest, even though it is the newest one for the deck. That wasn't in the first round. It's still the weakest card. So we have to cut one of those. Well, while you're searching, as for me, I'm taking out Nissa Vital Force, one Tamiyo, and Nicol Bolas, because he's a little expensive, and if I get to eight mana, that's a lot of mana anyway. So much mana. Tons of mana. Hmm. The last cut is always the hardest. And the deepest. Or is that the first cut? I think the first cut's the deepest. Is it? Or maybe it's one of the ones in the middle. I mean, it depends how many cuts you're getting. That's true. If you're getting a flurry of cuts, could be any of them. Could be the deepest, really. I think it's actually going to be another dark deal. Okay. All right. So, now that we're done sideboarding, I will be going first in game two. All righty, game two. Show my hands. That's what I have. Go ahead. And I've got hand. Okay. So I'm going to lead things off with a windswept heath, which I will crack going to 19. And I do believe this is going to get me a basic forest <laughs> because uh, I don't want to get blood boomed on turn one. No. <laughs> or I don't. I mean, I, I could get blood boomed on turn one, but I don't want it to uh, ruin the rest of my yeah. game plan. So. Might as well get the forest out quickly. And a noble hierarch. Get all that kind of Deal. colored mana. Yeah. Draw. Yeah, sometimes it's just nice to well to have some mana. I think we're gonna go for blood cleave cliffs. Black cleave cliffs. And an inquisition. Heath. 
Two mana accelerants and two We're dudes. We're going to take this one. Okay. Enter go. Draw a card. It's not horrible. Um, going to play another har Hierarch. And I'll attack you for two. <gasps> 18. And then I'll play a Simic Growth Chamber, returning forest to my hand. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. I think we're going to play... Blood Crypt Tapped. Yep. And Thought Seize You. And Elspeth or Sargon? Elspeth is the scarier one. Okay. Go to 16. Enter go. Untap. Draw a card. Well, that's fine. Um... Let's see. Guess I've got a lot of that mana. Damn manas. So, what I'll do is I'll replay that forest, and we'll cast an Oath of Nyssa. That allows you to cast that Sarkin now. Well, I mean, I could I could have fetched for something before yeah. to get it as well, but... Um... Huh. Well, I don't have a ton going on, so I think we're going to get a Garrick. Garrick! Could also cast that if I wanted to. And then, yeah, you'd have, yeah. you'd have almost enough mana to cast another Planeswalker. Exactly. Um, but I think I would rather get Sark and Vol in play. And he'll go up to five. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Okay. Blood Crypt. Yep. Untapped. Going to 14. We're going to use two red to cast Manamorphose. Um, making two red. Storm one. Where are you? Draw a card. And then we're going to use that two red to cast Desperate Ritual. Storm two. To make three red. Exile Simeon Spirit Guide for a red. And five mana for Reforge the Soul. So I discard those. Storm I discard three. Inquisition and a black leaf. This is draw seven, right? Yes. This one. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And... Well, that's unexciting. <laughs> no seeming spirit guide for this one. So, is your go. Okay. I may have given you too much of a value for that. Perhaps. We'll untap. Now I almost wish I would have left in that bolus, because I'm close to <laughs> casting him. <laughs> Draw a card. Which is kind of hilarious, actually. That's um, what ended up with. So I think for me, it's going to be... You're at how much life? 14. 14 life. Hmm. 1, 2, 3. Sarkin's going to go up to 6, pumping my team. Yep. Given haste. Given haste. Do you want to make a beast and. Make a beast? Well, you could have... Oh, right. You discarded, <laughs> discarded Garrick. Garrick. Right. I got rid of him. Yeah. Um, I'm going to play a Windswept Heath. Crack that. Going to 18. And I think I have just the basic planes in here. At this point, I just don't want to... Uh, I don't want to give you an easy grape shot, so that's why I'm fetching basics. And Othanus is in place, so it doesn't really make a difference. Yeah, you already have the oath, so... Yeah. And then I'm going to go for a it double hurt me season. a lot more than it would hurt you, because yeah. I have three non-basics, so I mm -hmm. lose all my black. Doubling season. Go. Doubling season with dragons next turn. Yes. Untap. Whole bunch of dragons. Draw for turn. Well, you're way too late. But we have swamp. Yep. 
And then how do we solve all our problems? I guess we just probably have to go for one. Burning inquiry. Okay. Storm one. So, so draw three. If there was ever draws that was maybe allowing me to win this, those were the ones. Okay. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine as well. Um, don't like that one. Definitely don't like that one. And that one was mean to me in high school. I'm going to say this one, and then this one. Yep. And this one. No whammies, no whammies, no whammies. So you got a dream salvage. You got to reforge the soul. You got a black creek cliff. You got a firewalker. Firewalker's pretty good. All right. So let's go for. Desperate ritual. Storm two. Three black, three red. Yeah. <laughs> I can work. Wrong straight. ritual. Wrong ritual. Yeah. Costs one more mana and it's not black. We're going to use the black and one of those red. Mm hmm. For a waste knot. Three. Now we're going to attempt to not waste that by going for. <laughs> not going to waste the waste knot? Another burning inquiry. I'm going to respond to that by natural stating the waste knot. Ah. Uh. Storm four. <laughs> <sighs> that was if you hit that, I'm like I might be in serious trouble now, but you didn't, so pretty happy about that. Yeah, I was kind of going to be relying on that mana. Yeah, <laughs> I figured. Five, six, seven, eight. Those. I'm gonna say these two and that one. Okay. Narset, Sylvan Carrotted, and a land. Blood Moon, Mountain, like and Grape Shot. Maybe. maybe. Unfortunately, because I have no more black mana, is your go. Yes, it worked! I didn't get the draw six. My brilliant ploy worked. Draw card. Um, hmm... Okay. Well. That natural state. It's pretty good. This is a very interesting conundrum I've got myself into here. Huh. Let's see. Well, I think... So I'm at 18. So I can pretty safely... Do this. Untap Temple Garden, come to 16. Core Firewalker. And then we'll make 5 mana to cast another doubling season. Oh my god. And then we will make <laughs> 20 <laughs> 4 4 red. We dragons. don't have that many tokens. No, we don't. But uh, that's what you can come close. Do. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, t is this 11? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, times 2. Uh, so, Reforge the Soul. That's my out. And you, and, and into, because of... Into Summon Sanity. Yeah. But even, uh, keep in mind, you cannot get a Grape Shot win. That's true. With uh, what's currently in place here. So, I'll pass the turn. Untap. I guess I still have that mana floating for a while. Yeah. <laughs> Draw Core for Firewalker turn. will gain me life for every red spell well, you cast. That's... You know what? I assume it wasn't a reforge or you would have miracled it. We're going to spend two mana. Yep. To cast Heretic Ritual. 17. Storm 1. We're going to use a black and red to cast Waste Knot. Yep. And we're going to... Sorry, yeah. Yep. Use these, and we're going to use that three red to cast a Simian Spirit Guide. <laughs> 18 <Enter> go. <laughs> okay, untap. I got a monkey. Draw a card. Monkeys are sweet. You Everyone got, likes monkeys. Yeah, you got 24-4 dragons, though. Yeah. 
So, okay, now now I'm gonna I'm gonna do something that uh, was kind of funny from before here. Um, so I'm kitties? gonna. No, I wish. I wish I could do kitties. But I'm gonna play in the Hiri the Harbinger, and because I have two <laughs> doubling seasons in play, it comes in with 16, because it's exponential. Yeah. It comes in with the uh, 16 counters. But, okay, so here's the thing, right? I'm gonna go down 8 <laughs> to search my library for an artifact or creature, put it onto the battlefield, shuffle my library, it gains haste, return to my hand at the beginning of end step. Look what's in my hand. <laughs> So, uh, let's see what's in here. Man, that Noble Hierarch. It's pretty yeah. good. Swing in. Pretty good. Well, I'm, it, it's probably the other Core Firewalker. Yeah? Yeah, that's that's the best option. <laughs> so, uh... Well, core Firewalker. Yeah. No, uh, Garrick to give all your dragons plus three, plus three, and trample, huh? No. <laughs> Unfortunately. Come on, where are you? Big old number. This is hardly worth the joke. <laughs> or did I discard the other? I think I discarded the other one, didn't I? It's a bird, maybe? Yeah, I discarded the other one. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we get a hierarch. Why not? And, uh. I mean, you can attack. And I think. I think it would probably be wise. I also gain a life from playing the Hiri. 19. I think it might be worth it to attack you for. What is this here? 80. 82. <laughs> 82. I mean, you may as well swing at this noble hierarchs. Yeah. They do have haste, or the one has That's haste. That's true. That's true. And then my monkey can do something. 82. 82. Well, the monkey can't do anything, so yeah. I'm dead. All right. 14 minus 82 <laughs> equals dead. <laughs> okay. So, that was kind of a sweet game, too. <laughs> that natural state. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was a wonderful draw. Okay, so, I don't think I'm going to change much of my sideboard strategy. I kind of like where it is. And, uh... You? And of course, I could add anything? damnation as a potential yeah. out to those kind of shenanigans. True. <laughs> you could do that. But I don't think I'm going to. Yeah. It's probably not quite good enough. Because most of my other planeswalkers don't care about... It's only Sarkin that would care about sweepers. So, we'll see you in game three. Alrighty, game three. So, go ahead. We got... Doze. Whoop. Doze. Well, I've got D's. <laughs> That's what I'm working with. Go ahead. This is a really sweet matchup. It is. You people that voted, uh, voted nicely. Yes, indeed. We've had two excellent games. Start us off here. Black Leaf Cliffs. Into with Otsies. We're just going to try and uh, nip any problems in the butt. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, what do we take? Hmm. I think we take... Birds. Probably a good choice. You take two. Enter go. Yeah, 18. You did. Draw a card. That's funny. Um. <laughs> did you just drop birds? Because I'm going to be annoyed. No, I didn't drop birds. Uh, how worried am I about a blood moon immediately? How worried? I do have the rituals, so that is always a possibility. Yeah. Play windswept heath and pass turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Well, I think we're gonna go for bloodstained mire. Yep. Crack that. Going to seventeen. It's gonna find us a swamp. So, Ritual, Blood Moon, Seeming Spirit Guide, Blood Moon, all pretty bad options for me. Not for you. Yes. They're pretty good options for you. Fortunately, I think it's just going to be a waste knot. Okay. Enter go. I'm going to crack this, going to 19, end of turn. And as much as I really, really want to get a forest... I think I gotta have to get a temple garden. <gasps> it's garden. It's true. 
There's a garden. Untap. Draw a card. Oh. Okay. Um. Is this like. Oh, I just drew my forest? No. <laughs> it better not be. Oh, I just drew natural state. Hmm. Tap Temple Garden. Go. Untap. Draw for turn. Black Cleave Cliffs. Yep. Burning Inquiry. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. You're kidding you me. Got it. Draw three. Well, there's a card. I got all my sideboard cards that game. Apparently. Because I had both firewalkers, firewalkers as well. One, two, three, four, that's, that's five, what six, this is coming seven, down to. eight. <laughs> apparently. Yink. I'm a take. This one's a firewalker. This one's a firewalker. And I take this one for good measure. Okay. I'm going to see if those top two, or those bottom two now, for firewalkers. Well, one, one was, was right for once. One was right. What did I get? I... You know what? I just piled them all up. <laughs> Come on, that's not fair. <laughs> that's not fair. I now did, I'm gonna. I did a dumb. Now I'm gonna take those ones. Okay. So you got. <laughs> Damn it. Dream salvage. Blood say Meyer. And Anamorphos. All right. I mean, out of all the cards, I think those were the ones that you wanted. That's good for me. Yeah. I mean, I do. I can do Inquisition. Ugh. Jeez. So that Firewalker. Yeah. Well, that's all my sideboard cards used. <laughs> that's one was cast good for me. One was cast. Here we go. Draw a card. Well, that's okay, I guess. Um, untap stomping ground seventeen. Carried and a hierarch. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Cards in hand. Two. Two. Uh, let me guess. They're doubling season and doubling season. Yes. <laughs> Here we go. Untap. Draw a card. Doubling season. Pass the turn. Draw for turn. That's... I mean, it's not a miracle, but... It's burning inquiry. Okay. Draw At three. At least gets us somewhere. Seem likely. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we both have five. Look at that. Those two and that one. Well, in that case. Look that. These three? This could be bad. This could be oh, bad. I got the reforge. The Season Nahiri and Oath. You got Nahiri. Ah, heretic ritual. Heretic ritual. Cards in hand? Two. Well, I guess I should keep track of what's been discarded. Just in case. Those ones. Inquisition. Narset, Temple Garden. Enter go. Oh! Looks like someone's not casting any spells! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that's how it's gonna end. I'm gonna cast a Narset, who comes in with 12 counters. Because of doubling season. And I'm gonna... Use nine of those counters, putting her to three, to get an emblem with your opponents can't cast non-creature spells. Well, in response... Are you going to cast one? I'm going to cast Metamorphose. Yeah, why Drawing not? a card. You can cast Simeon Spirit Guide. You can still win this. You can you can still do it. Yeah. And I'll attack you for two. <laughs> Fifteen. And I'll play a Wood of Foot Hills and pass the turn. Untap. Once Is again? Simeon Spirit Guide. Don't have... Uh, Emblem, so we'll use Mr. Boopster. His mountain. And I think this is how it's going to go, so it should go. <laughs> Crack that. 16. <laughs> Just for thinning, because I want to draw something sweet. Uh, mountain. So close. Why not? <laughs> it was pretty close. That natural state. <laughs> that natural state. It's a very good card. Both times. Did I do that twice? You did it in game one. Or game two. You had it on mm, perfect time, too. Right. Okay, something sweet on top, and I'm gonna get you to cut me because I want I want you to 
put something sweet on the top for me. Decide my fate. Otherwise, I'm just hitting with this noble hierarch. Oh, sorry. Did I say for two last turn? Yes. It was only for one. Because this is a carry to another hierarch. <laughs> I mean, okay. you do have Narset who can now go up to That's true. find things. And also, she should be at three. Yes. Yeah, but she can find non-creature, non-lands. Which, which I guess is a planeswalker. Yeah, that's true. So, she'll go to four. Which is all the planeswalkers in the deck. Yes! Sargon! Sargon Bowl! That goes to my hand. Yes, it does. Um, There's a whole bunch of dragons. That's true. And I think that'll kill me after I'm gonna that. I'm going to play another Hierarch. Then I'm going to cast Sarkin Vol. Yeah, He comes in with eight counters. And I'm going to use six of them to make ten five four four dragons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I ten. I believe we had the ten. Yeah. yeah. It was the twenty that was the problem. Yes, yes. And I'll attack you for two. 14. Pass the turn. Well, I mean, clearly even if this was a Simeon Spirit Guide. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to play this Blood Crypt untapped. Going to 12. Sounds good. Sure go. Untap. Draw a card. I mean, Sarkin can now pump all his dragons. That's true. Fives. Using our set. Take a look. Boo. Boo. <laughs> I really wanted to make an army yeah, of kittens. Yeah, like a Garrick. Yeah. Or, but, yeah, an army of kittens. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, so Sarkin's gonna go up. Creatures I control get plus one, plus one, and haste until end of turn. So, that's... 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50... 52. 52. <laughs> Thank you for 52. Uh, 12 minus 52 is, uh, negative 30, and that is dead. All right! Negative 40. <laughs> that's math. Yeah, apparently. So... Season Walkers, still the reigning champion. Yeah. Although, I must admit, this is probably one of the sweetest matches we've had in a very long time. It really was. This was a really good matchup. So, uh, yeah. So, for voting next week, uh, Atkiss will either be playing Burn, Green Weenie, Thopter Sword, or Demigod Dredge. Vote in the little do, do, do hickey thing. And, Damn uh, low. yeah. And we'll we will see, see you next time. on Friday. Bye. Bye.